Hey y'all, it's me again, Valerie. Welcome back to my yarn room. Yay! Okay. I got... Sorry about my hair. I got flyaway pieces going everywhere. and They're going to be blowing around because I got a fan over here, okay? Notice anything different? My daughter decided to help me clean up quite a bit in here in the yarn room. So, we rearranged a whole bunch of stuff. So now I've got actual room to walk through the yarn room. <laughs> There's a lot more to do, but I'm getting there. I come on here today, um, before I get started on that. If you haven't already, I'd appreciate it if you'd hit that subscribe. When you do, give us a thumbs up, share if you can, and leave me a comment. Love reading y'all's comments. Okay, I come on here today specifically to show what I just recently got for my birthday. I'm going to say Happy Mail Yarn Unboxing, but um, it was hand-delivered. <laughs> Sorry, had an itch. Um, but this is what my mother-in-law got me for my birthday. She also made me a pan of lemon bars. Oh, ooey, gooey deliciousness oh my god they were so good so good okay what every crocheter needs can't get enough of it she got me a thing hand lotion and I love lemon love it the, the uh, scent of this is um, lemon citrus. And you can smell the lemon in it. I've used it. It's really nice lotion. Yeah. Okay, so, thing of hand lotion. And this beautiful card. Got a handwritten note in it, and I'm not going to read it because it's private. Um, each birthday begins a year of new beginnings, new possibilities, new dreams coming true. That's what the front of it says. And I love the wheat. Yeah. Okay, so there's that. So now I have two cards to put on my, my strip. Yeah. And here is the big one. Cannot pronounce the second name on it at all. But I got three skeins of yarn. Okay, I'm put them two down. I took this one out. Nako. And if you can pronounce that bottom word, good for you. I cannot. <laughs> and let me tell you, this yarn is unbelievable. I'd say it's probably about a DK.
and it looks chain spun, but it's not. It's twisted. You can tell by the, the end piece that it's twisted. But the twist on this is so tight that I don't think there's any way for it to split. And let me tell you the amounts of how soft this yarn is. If you ever get a chance to get this yarn, I recommend it. I will be getting more. Definitely. Um, it does not tell what the yardage on each skein is, but it does say that it's 100 grams, 225 meters, and uh, let's see, made in Turkey, it's got the, the Ogatech stamp on it, which means that it's been tested for, um, uh, allergies and harmful substances and uh, it says that it is 100% premium microfiber that's what makes this so soft so if you ever get a chance to get NACO yarn I highly suggest it I really like the way, how soft the um, Premier Everyday Anti-Peeling Yarn is. Because, I mean, y'all know. If you, if you ever touched it, you know. It is, like, silky like butter. I think this is, might be softer. I really do. And it smells so clean. But yeah, I, I just wanted to come on here and tell y'all what I got. And that I highly suggest Nako Yarn. It's unbelievable. I'm going to take them three skeins and try to um, crochet like a, a tank top. For myself, um, <clears throat> oh, I think that'll be gorgeous. Gorgeous. <laughs> All right, well, I ain't gonna keep y'all. Just wanted to come on here and chat for a minute. Uh, don't forget, I have that uh, special TGIFFW video that. You might need to comment on. Yeah. Alright. Oh, and I got a couple of newbies. So, hey y'all. Glad y'all could join us here. Alright. I will meet y'all back here in the next one. For another grand adventure. Right here. In Val's Yarn Room. And don't forget... The yay! <laughs> oh, goodness. Um, I love each and every single one of y'all to pieces. And do something nice for somebody. Even if it's just a smile. Alright. Y'all get your crochet, y'all. Bye, y'all.